And here we go. Wow, it did drop a lot of stuff, you know? <laughs> drop it like it's hot. <laughs> so it's kind of weird how the three of us are all kind of doing different things as well at the minute in terms of, uh, you know, what we're putting out. Because I've just started the podcast, which I know you do, Barry. Are you on iTunes, by the way, Barry? Uh, no, because I am anti-Apple and I don't know how to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Because uh, I've, I've launched a new podcast, which is on on, on pretty much everything at the minute. Um, I think you have my sword, by the way. Sorry. Oh, what was... Uh... And... Do you want me to... Um, I've got some iron. I, I've got some iron. Do you want me to make iron picks or iron swords? Iron picks. We need some for the redstone. Oh, star. crap. Over there. Enderman. Right, okay. I've oh, just thrown you. two iron picks down, which Barry got both. Yeah, right. sorry. <laughs> Come back. So we need to go further down again, then, don't we? Yeah. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, oh, dear. <laughs> you know how inappropriate I am. Come on. <laughs> oh crap. Oh, I just about survived. What the hell? How did you not die then? I don't know. Oh wow, there's lava there as well. So you were really close. Hey, the floor is lava. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see if we can... Right, there's some, uh, there's some iron ore down here as well. So what's been your worst moment on YouTube then, Barry? What's what's been sort of a I want to quit moment? Talking to you. <laughs> uh, I don't know. See, like, no, like I'm sure we all have days as well. Like, like you do get like fed up. Do you get me? Yeah, yeah. Where it gets, it's like I just I couldn't be arsed anymore. Like, like you just want a break. You know, it's like you need to take a break. Yeah, yeah. You can't, you can't do it. Like yesterday, you can't do it all day, every like, day. Yeah. Need... Like yesterday, I uploaded four videos to get them up wow. straight away because of Splatoon and stuff, you know. Yeah. That's yeah. that's that's the world we live in, as and you have to get like get you know first up as you know soon as possible, kind of thing. Unfortunately. So so, do you ever suffer from the uh, you know the the typical uh, YouTube trolls? negative comments and stuff like that as well well i knew that i'd sort of been successful if you if you want on youtube when i got a comment of you are a cunt <laughs> <laughs> and it was it was that comment that I, I knew that i knew that i'm attracting the right people and, and people that... <laughs> you're a cunt I, I, I can't believe you invited me to the stream after that as well <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, like I guess the past few days I've had like, oh, this guy is terrible. Look, I know I was okay. It's a video of Levels Plus. It's a, a Switch game. Yeah. I got early hands on, and like I know I was bad at it, and that's why I uploaded myself playing the game, but uh, like without uh, like, like a new upload of get me of me playing the game. Did you die there? All right. Yeah. But no commentary, but me kicking ass in it though. But it's like, just leave me alone, go away, will you? Yeah, too, there's too many sort of keyboard warriors, yeah. isn't there, and things like that. It's it's more YouTube's just for it's just an outlet for 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 this, isn't yeah. it? You know, for for enjoying yourself, having fun. And that's what it's all yeah, about. Yeah, but, no, but like YouTube, sorry, Gary, YouTube for me wouldn't be my uh, you know long term goal in life if you get me. Like I'll do it for fun, but like like there's other things I want to do as well. Yeah, it's not a career choice, no. is it? Not, not. You you can't make it a career choice at, at the same time as having a full time job. No. It it'd be nice to. Yeah. It's it's not. For me, it's not possible. Oh. And there I go again. Yeah, Gary. What what were you saying? Sorry. Uh, well, I was just about to say that I'm I'm, I'm bad at games. <laughs> I think I proved myself the new way there. <laughs> nice. But, you know, I'd, I'd never claim to be good at games, and I'm sure that um, 
where, whenever people upload videos onto YouTube, they don't start with a disclaimer of, hey, I'm awesome at this, you know, I've never yeah, played yeah. this game before, but I'm going to kick ass. So, when people get negative comments about it, when you, whenever you're watching somebody review a game, you know, if they've not played it before, they're, they're in the boat that they don't know what they're doing. And you can't expect someone to be great straight off the bat. Oh yeah, exactly. Like you're playing the game for the first time. It's like, of course, you're not going to bloody expect what to do hands off. Yeah, and I, f I think it's unfair sometimes when people are just going around firing. Oh, this guy's awful, you know, on the keyboard. But yeah, it, it's going to happen because YouTube's YouTube, as great as it is, is also it's also brought out the worst in some people as well. Yeah. Yeah, people people on the internet have got like something to hide behind, haven't they? That's a yeah. Thing. Yeah, can I talk about something as well? I, it was a while ago, but I, do, I haven't checked it up on the situation since. Do you know Markiplier? Yes. He was going through, my friend was telling me, he was going through a phase there where he didn't want to do YouTube. That kind of... Like... Yeah, I'd, see, I'd seen some. I'm not, I'm not too familiar, but I'd seen something like that, and they. See, um, yeah, like the thing is, he dyed his hair or something. Yeah, see, yeah, but I know he's doing that for charity and stuff. But the thing is, as well, he hasn't that I know of. He hasn't got like much hobbies outside YouTube because YouTube is his life. Yeah, but like, like you need to do something outside of YouTube. Like, like, like I know you can be with your friends, but like, do something else. Like, take up for talks like like a sport. You know, go you know, do shows or something, or like whatever you want to do. Like, you have to do something. Yeah, well that, that sort of, that that's mirrored with, with whatever you, you, you choose to do, isn't yeah. it? That's, that's the same sort of thing if you, if you, you, you're a, a footballer or if you, whatever. Yeah. It, it's, it's exactly the same uh, thing that you need, you need a hobby, don't you? You need, you need some something to sort of forget about the day-to-day -day things, yeah. don't you? So when you're doing YouTube as a a serious sort of thing, you need you, you need somewhere to. I don't, I don't know. I don't. I, I'm rambling. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. You lost yourself halfway through that one, then, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's like I mean. Oh, there's iron, there's iron ore there behind the behind the crafting table. I mean, it's it's literally got to be sort of a passion thing, doesn't it? I mean, I'm sure I'm sure you started uh, your YouTube channel maybe to just to just look for um, indie games, Barry. Actually, no. Okay, I'll tell you this here. The first video I uploaded, guess what it was? First game. Was it? Was it? Oh, first game. I'm gonna guess. Yeah. Call of Duty. It was actually. Yeah, What's Black that? Ops 2, yeah. Oh, no way. Like, of all things, you know, it's... Like... Like, I, I said this to Sun Games in a podcast a little while ago. Like, I... Yeah, that's, I've seen that. Yeah, like, I didn't... Like, you know, we all have a, an impression of indies. I, I, I understand that, you know. Like, you know, oh, like, this, this looks, like, terrible or whatever. Like, it's not your, your big AAA title-looking game. Like, Call of Duty. Mm. But Sick of the Man was the first indie game that I had that like the quality was so high. I think I think that's that shines from the art style, doesn't oh, it? Oh yeah, but like he, like the whole game was just so professional. Like that was made by what was it, seven, eight people, whatever it was at the time. Yeah. Yeah, it's only a small it was only a small team. And it's just ridiculous. Like they can produce this game. And like you see, like the, like the biggest companies in the world, like EA and whoever else, you know, like they've hundreds of people on games, and it turns out terrible overall. Yeah, I, I I've got a similar sort of thing. I, it was a uh, Bit Trip Runner, the first one, which was the game that I sort of, I downloaded and sort of fell in love with. And um, the, the thing is with indies as well is if if you were a fan of the retro heroes, they sort of have so many throwbacks and. And you get the same sort of feelings as playing some of the old games sometimes as well. Yeah. Even if they're not necessarily Should we stop block that, that way off, Barry? Hmm? Should we block that way off and then when we don't oh, get... if you want. Oh, no, it's it's not... I thought it was a big cave system, but it's not, is it? No. Okay. Sorry, Gary, you were saying? Yeah, yeah uh, um... 
I can't remember. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, bed that. trip, yeah. Even if they're not in the style of old games necessarily, you know, like Shovel Knight is, but like I say, and Bit Trip Runner, which is the game that uh, I was talking about, is. But something like Stick It to the Man, even even if it's not necessarily in the style of an old game, sometimes you still get the same feeling as like playing an older game. Yeah, yeah. And I think it's just because they, they don't complicate things. It's not a million and one online options. There's not DLC going to cut them for two minutes. Yeah, yeah. So I think I think it makes it a bit of a better experience sometimes. I've found Redstone. Found Redstone. <laughs> I've also found a zombie. <laughs> Good for you. I, th I forgot we was playing Minecraft for a second. Then you know, we all this rambling about uh, YouTube. I know. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I think I think it's great that there's so many content creators as well at the minute that are just doing it, just just out of fun, really. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure I'm sure the three. What I what I found, what I found a, a lot Ooh. just lately is people are, are doing it because they want to be famous, yeah. and people are doing it because they want to get free games or they want to, you know what I mean? They've all got a, a sort of an idea that that everyone who does YouTube just sort of gets free games or Me, gets, I get free you know, games. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And and no one well us anyway, we don't do it for, yeah, for yeah. that. It's 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 nice it's nice to get free stuff because it means that you don't have to spend as much to, to, to do this sort of thing, but it's yeah. not why you like, it's it, basically so. a bonus. But I think as well too Because you'd be buying you'd be getting the games anyway. Yeah, you? regardless, yeah. Nice one, whoever's done that. <laughs> You're welcome. Harry. <laughs> <laughs> Look over here, quick. <laughs> <laughs> Has he blocked him in? Uh, nothing, Paul. Don't worry about it. Uh, yeah, like, yeah. what else? Well, yeah. <laughs> the, like, the free games is a bonus, you know. And, like, what I found as well with Nintendo. Like, like they have all this big hype on helping out indie developers when yeah. they do they do feck all advertising for them. Yeah, yeah. And it's like you know, I'm not I'm not trying to be cocky or big headed, but like I do better advertising for them indies well, than bloody Nintendo does. That's actually how I find out about most of my indies at the minute is through you, but um, more than Nintendo as well. So yeah. you're actually perfect. Well, right they don't give them it. any exposure, do they? That's yeah. They don't give no. They don't help them at all whatsoever. Yeah, they've got that thing though, haven't they, where they're saying that if it's not released a uh, day in date or first... Yeah, then... they're, they're very particular about, you know, everything. It's like, feck off, just you know, help them out, will you, regardless. Yeah. And I mean, so, some of the games really need the help. Like, and I mean, it is going to help, even if it's by... <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, I've got 10 redstone, that'll do us, won't it? Should do. Sorry, Gary, you were saying... It should do, yeah. <laughs> um, even if it's only going to shift one or two extra consoles, it's still going to shift something, so they still need help. Yeah. The, the, the thing that I think, though, is, is with indie games, nobody buys a console because an indie game's coming to the, to the console. Yeah. You, you know what I mean? No one wants to, no one wants to buy a, a, a Nintendo Switch because Shovel Knight is on it, or... You understand yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's something that you sort of you buy it because Zelda's on it, or you buy it because um, Mario Kart or something like that, and then you sort of supplement supplement your your library with the indie games, yeah. don't you? I haven't yeah, played Mario Kart in a while, oh, like only with friends. But that's it, though. To be honest. Yeah, I th I, that was actually a friend playing Mario Kart again. I played it for the. Uh... You know the super indie. Uh oh. I'm uh oh. On. <laughs> hold on, hold on, wait. wait. Oh no. I brought it. Oh no. There we're we all go. gonna drown. I, br I brought <laughs> it for the super indie podcast tournament thing that was happening, and uh, haven't played it since. I've I've played it quite a bit. I play it every Friday night uh, on stream. Yeah. Well, okay, Gary, look, look, I'll tell you this right. When 3D uh, Land came out for 3DS. Yeah. I was like, eh, I just thought it was just okay. I wasn't too pushed on it. But then, like, a year later, I loved it. I, I played it non-stop. Yeah. Which I, I don't understand, though. 
No, I actually did the similar sort of thing with 3D Land. I wasn't too keen on it to start with, but uh, I went on holiday and, and took it with me, and then I ended up completing it then. <laughs> yeah. Um, I think I think everybody had that 3D Land now because it was it was a weird concept, really, wasn't it? It was like 2D style, but in a kind of 3D way. Like I think they were kind of going for like like a a, a cheapest kind of galaxy game. Yeah. Which I, I think people wanted, one. but you know it didn't happen. What? Uh, should we go this way? So if if we if we head onto another map now and then create a map. Wait, what? <laughs> if you 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 can only you can only make new maps of the area by being it being off the map that you're on. If that makes sense. Yeah. Just follow me. <laughs> <laughs> 